Welcome back everybody. So today we're going to try Hop Tarts from Dewclaw Brewing Company. Now this is the strawberry milkshake version of it. So strawberry milkshake IPA. Uh, 16 fluid ounces, 7.2% ABV. I did look this up on Untapped and it looks like they have a blueberry version. Uh, but when I picked this up at MegaBev, I did not see that this is the only one they had. I did pay $4.09 for this. It looks like on the bottom that it's 10 22 22 or something like that but there's a red or a blue like marker and so i can't see so uh it definitely says 10 then something 2022 20, on there so this would be under three months old as this is the beginning of 2023 so let's go ahead and get this open and get it into a glass i'm not going to roll it i don't believe it says to roll it so i'm not gonna so yeah let's just open it there we go Wow, definitely not what the color I thought it was going to be. Milkshake IPAs, I'm used to kind of the color of a New England IPA, like that milky yellow in color, just with lactose in there. Um, so this could be kind of interesting. I can already see a lot of stuff floating in there. Off-white colored head, it looks like a little yellow is coming up through there. Pretty much all small bubbles. Uh, finger of head from that pour. Um, oh yeah, there is lots of stuff in there. Holy cow. That did say 22, right? Yes, 22. Um, golden, yellow, slight orange. Um somewhat hazy but get ready i believe you guys can see all that stuff floating in there um do they really use pop tarts in this i guess we'll have to see what it says on untapped let's go ahead and smell Definitely got that lactose, maybe that maltiness like you would see in a Pop-Tart, like the outer part, and then that lactose sweetness, the glaze on top of it. I, I would definitely also say strawberry, um, like a dry strawberry, like opening a bag of dried strawberries and smelling them. Uh, that's the smell, but there's some like lactose sweetness and breadiness in there. I don't know. Do they really use strawberries or is that fake? I don't know. It's like that, that breadiness, that crust. And then the, the strawberry smell, I can't tell if it's real or if it's fake. From the color, I would all, eh, depending on how much they put in there, but there is a ton of stuff floating in there. I don't know. I can't tell if it's a natural flavoring or if they actually smushed up strawberries and put them in here. Let's go ahead and taste. That tastes good. The strawberry taste is like the dried strawberry. It kind of, that strawberry taste kind of reminds me of M43 strawberry and Bell's uh, strawberry milkshake IPA. So it definitely has that strawberry taste, not as much sweetness um in there is that a bad thing in my opinion no because i think that strawberry gives it a little bitterness i'm hoping they're using hops in here and that bitterness is coming through also nice and smooth it almost feels like this should be cloudy that yellow milky color um very slick almost like they're using oats um, it's got that consistency, but 
the lactose, I'm not getting, I'm getting a little bit of sweetness, but I almost want to say it's from dried strawberries. It's not from adding lactose, which I don't think this says contains lactose. on there. Huh. Why don't we just hazy this thing or oh yeah, look at that. There. Now you can definitely see it. I would almost say it's crushed up Pop Tarts. I think it's yeast. Yeast and trube. I'm guessing. Man that just reminds me of a beer that is out of date. It says 22. Now I can show you. See? It's definitely 22. I'm going to go 3.75 out of 5. Um, it's good. The strawberries there. Milkshake, though... I, I don't see it. I need more vanilla. I need a little bit more sweetness. That strawberry tastes like a dried strawberry, not a strawberry, like a homemade milkshake I, or a milkshake with strawberries in it. Um, it I'm, I'm still, I, I still can't tell you if it's artificial. It's nice. It, it's, it doesn't ruin the palate. There is a little maltiness there, but I need that vanilla um, to make that milkshake part, at least in my opinion. So 3.75 out of 5. Let's check on tapped. Uh, none of my friends have had it. Almost 600 people, 3.79 out of 5. So um, they still don't say anything in the style guidelines. So uh, strawberry, creamy, smooth, hoppy, rich. I could actually go with creamy, but I think that's the mouthfeel. I'm guessing they're using oats, and that's why it is kind of slick. But creamy, I, I could definitely see that. Let's see if anybody said anything. As this, as none of my friends have had it, usually nobody posts anything. Yeah, I don't see anything. But yeah, definitely one to pick up and try if you're into milkshake IPAs. If you enjoyed this review, check some more out over here. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell. And until next time, cheers.